The Young Bucks, Kenny Omega, and Adam Page re-signed to AEW. Wow. Who saw that coming, huh? <laughs> um, of course, it's been, um, been reported that at least one of them has signed a four-year deal. Um, and why not? Where else are they going to go? Um, and Omega and the Young Bucks will also be retaining their EVP status with the company. Um, because if they resigned or if they signed with someone else like WWE, they would not get those EVP positions. Because, of course, someone like, you know, WWE actually has real people that know what they're doing with that EVP position. Not like over here. Um, that EVP status for the, the Bucks and Omega is just a joke um, I, in my eyes. Um, but... Of course, it was um, indicated that WWE did have interest in all all of them, but there was no serious talks, um, and and I can see why. Um, the Bucks they've been overrated uh, for years. Um, I know they they tried WWE tried getting them back in 2018, but that fell through, um, and all three of them were worth something back then was that five years ago uh now not so much uh out of the four uh omega i i, I like omega more than page more than the young bucks um so yeah this this is uh typical um because they're not going to get the freedom anywhere else well not in the big leagues of wwe uh, they can still go to Japan and all that. Um, but yeah, I, this was typical news that they were going to sign and, and for years. But who else is going to take them? That's, that's how I see it. 